Hey guys, so today we're going to be using this Arduino Mega and this Arduino Due Milanove to burn the bootloader onto these uh, AT Mega 328s, okay? So I have two of them that I'm going to burn the bootloader onto. What I'm going to do, so so this is really, what. let me explain what I'm doing first. Uh, what I'm doing is basically, you can, you can already buy pre-bootloader uh, burn chips on SparkFun if you don't want to do this. Um, so there, it's going to cost you an extra dollar or so. So this way you can basically save a dollar, and you can buy AT Mega 328s in bulk, and you can't really buy pre-bootloader burn chips uh, in bulk. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this Arduino Mega board to program the Douay Milanove. So what we got to do first is take out the um, 328 on the Douay Milanove. So my technique for this is to get one of these things and sort of pry it from either side. It's a bit harder from from this side to actually get in there. But you just want to be real gentle with it because these chips are around five dollars a piece. So while they're not super expensive, they're not the cheapest. So there we go. AT Mega 328. There's a chip. It's a little scratched on the bottom, but it'll be okay. So I have my new boards here. Um, I'll just get out some scissors. And there are the chips. All right, so what I'm going to do is take one out. And you notice the pins are going to be a little splayed. So what you want to do is you want to just gently rock it on the table until they become straight. But they're still splayed, so. See, the left side looks more straight now, while the right side is still splayed out. I'm not quite sure why they come like this, because nobody actually uses them splayed. But you see, there we go. It's, it's now very much straight. Then you want to make sure to line the notch on the chip up with the notch marked on the PCB. And don't force it in these sockets. Um, just gently sort of rock it in. Um, but these sockets, like I said, are a little bit stiff. But chips in there now. Okay. So. Now we're going to use our Mega to program it. So what we've got to do now And that's it. So we're going to use this board to program this board. So now all I'm going to do in the software is make this board, give it the Arduino ISP sketch. So that's going to make this board emulate an ISP controller. Then we're going to, um, then we're going to switch the board to this Duet Milanofe and click upload the bootloader. And it's going to go through. You can find this tutorial on the Arduino website. Um, for more information, I just want to show you how it's done. So, 